Okay, yeah, I've taught you how where the strings go, E, A, D, G, B, E. So we're gonna go for the sip string. This is the top string. And here we go, here's Danny. Time now to put it on. So yeah, what you, what you do is, is on my guitar, which is a Johnny Cash turtle back. You've got the little holes here. I put it through the hole like that. And I thread it through. You put it tight to make sure it's in. And then you get to the, the top bit. And you start to thread it through. There's your, there's your threads. So you just basically get it, push it through like that. And then you just wrap it around a couple of times. You just wrap it around a couple of times like that. Just to give it some sort of grip. I make it a bit loose, so I've got so I've got to tie it to, and then and then I bring it home. Sometimes you get little accidents like that. But I try and hold it, and then I tighten it up. There you go, and you twist it. There you go, now I'm bringing it home. And that is the top E fitting. You can make a song out of one chord. This is Pink Floyd The Wall, listen. And then you've got um, an early Pink Floyd song, set the controls for the heart of the sun, all on one string, look. That's all in one string. So with one string, I can make a, a note, a sound out of my guitar. What will happen when I put the other five strings on? This is how to string your guitar, the way I string my guitar. And it might not be the way you, you string your guitar, this is the way I string my guitar. And guess what? I don't care how you string your guitar. There's people out there that like the way I string my guitar, and they will copy me the way I play it. But just because I don't do it the way you do it, doesn't mean I'm good enough, or what, or better. We've all got our own way of doing things, so don't let anyone ever tell you that, oh, you should do it their way. Oh, you should do it my way. Do it any way you want, okay? And play your songs on one string. Listen, Pink Floyd the Wall, one string. There's so many songs you can learn with just one string. Don't ever give in and make sure you do it your way. This is how Danny Slog it, me. This is how I string my guitar. Hope I've taught you well. Oh no, we've got to put the other five strings on now. We well, just arrived at that one. Do you really need me to show you the next five? I can, I, sh I can do it twice, you know. There is two times I can do this. You think of the more songs I can make with two strings. So the next string, remember, Elephant Eight Danny's Dribbly Bits Every. So E A D G B E E A. A is the next, A is the next one we need. Which should be the fifth, because it goes top to bottom and bottom to top. In the guitar world, everything's upside down because you lay it down like that. But when you hold it up like that, it's then upside down. When you lay it like that, it's in the right way. Everything is symmetrical. Good, isn't it? Anyway, this goes the next string. You watch the, the strings I can make out of two strings. I'm just saying goodbye to some of my uh, groupies, some of my friends, lovely females, all under 30 years old. And they come round and watch me play guitar. 
And um, yeah, it's nice having groupies, nice females. They come and watch the King play guitar. They know the songs I can make out of one chord, one string. So they come and watch me for enjoyment. <laughs> so anyway, remember what I said, through the bridge, put your string, push it up like that. This is the second string going in. Remember, E, A. This is an A string. And then I put it in here. And I put it in that end like that. Put it all the way to the end. And then I wrap it round like that. Wrap it underneath like that. Under again. I put it so it's a bit loose. Keep it tight. And then I bring it home. It sometimes doesn't go to plan. I feel it getting tighter now. I like to put my hand on that so I can feel the tightness. So there you go, that is how I string my guitar. I'm now two strings through. There you go, that's just what I've got with two strings. And I will repeat the process with the next four strings. And this is how to restring your guitar. Make sure you learn the code. Danny's uh, Elephant 8 Danny's Dribbly Bits Every, E-A-D-G-B-E. -E. And then get your strings, put them on in order. And enjoy your guitar. Time to put the first string on. It's really nice to re restring your guitar yourself because uh, you're kind of doing the work for the enjoyment of playing. So you put it through the bridge like I just did, then you come to this end like that, and we're going to wrap it around here like this, push it through the hole. You know, I'm not the best guitar player, but I can play. And I can play quite a few songs. I can play a few of my own songs. So maybe, you know, maybe it's time that I started playing. If I can restring a guitar and I've been playing for over 20 years, then I'm sure it's time you guys saw me play more. So I look forward to uh, making more guitar things. I'm not the best guitar player, but I want things to do. And, I love, and I've always wanted to play guitar. There you go, it's the first string. There's a few songs you can play with three, three strings, three, a few more chords. If you go to the E minor. Well out of tune, but that should have been zombie. Anyway, you get the drift. Let's carry on. Elephant 8 Danny's G is the next one, which is the third string. G, G, G. G, G, G. Here we go. Elephant 8 Danny's Dribbly Bits Every. Mm. You could like make names up. There's Elephant, but I've got my own way. So now remember, the first thing you do, you feed it through the bridge. And you put it through.
Yeah, and then you go up to this end. You put it through the top one, top spindle of the guitar. Then you wrap it around a few times like that. Everything's back to front, I think, with the bottom three. But I'll get it, I'll get it eventually, I always get it. I'm good enough to string a guitar, so that's how good a player I am. I just wish I played it more because. It takes about one minute to put a string on. You've got to cut them all at the end. But you know, I could have done this quicker, but I was showing you little tricks. I was showing you songs I know with one chord. So there you go, that's the full string. E, A, D, G, Elephant, A, Danny's Dribbly. There you go, I've got two more to pick now. So we've got the fifth. I should have a pair of scissors here to open all these things, rather than my teeth. But anyway, that's life, I'm only one away. Here comes my assistant, the gorgeous Chema with the, the strings. Do you want to put your face in so they can see you? Yeah, they can see your hand. Hello. They might look back in a hundred years and want to see what Gemma looked like. Okay. Give them a little look of Gemma. Hi, this is Gemma. She just <laughs> brought the scissors to me. She's my assistant and she's got blue hair and I've got blue eyes and the sky is blue and so is the sea. Mwah, mwah. Shine on everybody. Make sure you learn how to string your guitar. Make sure you have fun while you do it. Here we go, next string. <laughs> so remember, you put it through the bridge, like I've showed you five times. And you put it through. That's it. And then you go up to this end, to the neck, the guitar neck. And you put it through the uh, hole. And then you wrap it around a few times. There you go, and then when you start twisting it like that, that's when uh, that's when you get the tightness. And you just keep turning it round until it gets tight enough. I would tune it afterwards, you see. It's not about tuning it now, it's just about fitting the strings. You know? So that is the fifth string. Elephant eight, Danny's dribbly bits. So this is the B, the B, the fifth is the B. That's the fifth string. And now I have the final string, which is another E, the, the top E or the bottom E, whatever way you want to look at it. And then you get your last string, which is the bottom E. You unravel it like this. And then, once you've unraveled it like this, you then put it through the bridge.
when you pull it through like that, and you go to the neck, put it through your little hole, and then you wrap it around a few times. Then you tight, you bring it home until it's tight. Twist it round, holding it so you don't break it. It's all kind of like, you know, you have to check the pressures. And then once you've done that, that is the sixth and final string I've just fitted, which is the E chord, the bottom E, or the top E. Top, bottom E, there's an E at the top, there's an E at the bottom. So that is how. Sorry. Imagine that breaking the bottom E on film. It does happen. You just buy another one. You can't beat yourself up over things that go wrong. Just get over it and get it, get it fixed. There you go. That is how to restring a guitar. tuned up now and um but you know i've just showed you how to restring an acoustic guitar and i've taught you what all the strings are e a d g b e elephant eight danny's dribbly bits every e a d g b e e a d g b e that is what each string is called that is what note it is and i've just showed you how to string a guitar and i've just taught you how to remember what the notes are shine E A D G B E E A D G B E. This is Danny Sluggett Vision on the 22nd of August, the year 2021. And I just showed you how to restring a guitar and what the chords are. Love you all. Shine on. Sh -sh -sh shine.